Hi everybody, Adam Broadway here from Platform OS, also known as Near Me Marketplaces. We're rebranding, as you may have already noticed, and Platform OS will be the site and the brand that we'll be running with. Just a quick update regarding the amazing things that have been happening over the last week. In particular, I just want to call out a couple of really cool pieces of development that's taken place by third-party partners. Scrivito has done an incredible job and Anthony on the team over there is using a staging site and within a couple of days or less, I mean it seemed like no time at all, they only just got their staging site set up late last week and then Anthony has a link for us with in-context editing already working. So here's the, the demo site, obviously it's running on our Californian region staging site and what we have is a typical website with content and I would like to actually start editing this. So let's click begin edit. Begin editing. This won't be a tutorial on how Scrivito works because I've never watched a tutorial or read anything. This is completely intuitive to me. Uh, having just had a couple of minutes to play with it, I've got a preview version. Uh, you can see the little Scrivito toolbar here. I'm able to see what versions are running. We've got a, a couple of other working copies done by different people and I can also look at other information relating to this page, creating new pages, sub pages. Not every piece of functionality has been integrated as yet. The team over there are working on that and of course I wanted to see a different view of this. I'd like to see a mobile view of the page, tablet, etc. But then I want to make some changes. So as I go into edit mode, it will allow me to do those changes in context. Very straightforward. You can see my mouse is moving into different div regions. I can change properties of this particular region. Obviously, I can go in and make any copy changes that I need to. And I'm able to get rid of stuff that I've written earlier. Customize. It can be fully customized. Yay! So you've all seen in context editors many times before, but have you seen one that's been integrated over the top of a completely different platform, different CMS, in a matter of days, uh, making it a very, very awesome proof of concept that will become available to Business Catalyst partners should they wish to use it. So really cool, awesome work. Shout out to uh, Anthony on this and. I'm really impressed, I'm really impressed. It's amazing what uh, solid developers can do in a very short space of time. So, Scrivito, hats off to you guys. Well done, and I can't wait to see more. Other things going on. Okay, let's flick over to a little thing that Scott Reynolds did. And a big shout out to Scott Reynolds and also Adam Cook, who've just been, been relentless with their incredible dedication to working on the platform, giving us feedback. Uh, we've made some incredible strides forward from the feedback that they've been giving us, all based around what they believe is the best for the Business Catalyst community. So very appreciative of that involvement. But what Scott did, and in this video, we'll send you the link, I'm not going to play it all back here, but he basically went into Business Catalyst, took the HTML from a form, plugs it into the form configuration on platform OS, deploys the change, runs it, here you can see it's on the stage in California site, and then he submits the form, gets all the validation happening, gets a workflow alert happening, and all the things you would expect a web form to do, such as sending alert, capturing the data, sending an alert either via email, text, or actually we have API calls as a workflow alert as well, cut and paste. He dragged and dropped content, deployed it, he cut and paste from BC onto Platform OS and it just worked. Really impressive stuff. So Adam and uh, so Adam Cook and Scott are working on also some other things collaboratively to open source and give to the Business Catalyst partner, uh, partner community. So we're really excited by that and helping to support. Another thing that we also are going to be open sourcing and you'll be able to get to the GitHub repo for this, something that Pavel on our team put together. He went ahead and grabbed the Google Accelerated Mobile Pages templates and dropped them 
into platform OS to make sure that we can prove that we are also Google AMP compatible and being able to create accelerated mobile pages, which is going to be really important for you moving forward and for SEO in particular. Uh, he took the templates, you can see they're running on our Oregon staging demo site here, and uh, all just works. Let's go off into the land and see. Um, let's go and click on, actually let's go to travel and we'll go ahead and find an adventure. Everything that's working here, all of the controls, all of the ability to filter can be just wired back into the platform OS APIs and you are able to also maintain Google AMP compatibility because we support graph queries which will pull back JSON data directly from the database and all of the database objects that you create you have full access to and that comes via Elasticsearch so it's super super fast so that's a really cool thing again GitHub repo free open source we're going to be doing this with admin panels we're going to be doing this with migration tools we're going to be giving away a lot of code uh, in the hopes that you will take advantage of those and be building all your client sites on platform OS that uh, oh one more thing yeah uh, something that Dean um, at Cyclide put together very quickly was a, a little demo and uh, he did say specifically that this was just a proof of concept to make sure that everything we said we could do we could do so he built a little iOS native app which went off and display allows you to log in and then displays login information in a mobile app uh, so that was something that Dean at Cyclide put together as well very quickly so all the things that we said we can do looks like we can do them and looks like our back end is able to cope with some pretty heavy duty stuff and with the right people working with you you can achieve incredible things in fact the sky's the limit and you're only going to be limited by your imagination with building websites, applications, Internet of Things, connectivity, you name it. So thanks for your time. We will have more updates coming soon and a lot of great open source stuff to be able to give to the community. Thanks for your uh, time and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye.